Hello everybody. Today we are going to unbox an uninterruptible power supply made by APC. It's double boxed which is great. This is our model here. This is what we got inside. We have a warranty and papers. We have uh, this uh, coaxial cord and we have uh, ethernet cord. USB A to RJ45. We're not gonna be using this. It tells you here you need to connect the battery. It says here push it, take out, then connect the red connector and put back in. This is the battery. It's pretty heavy. We connected the plus. It's a little bit tricky, but you just push it in. Then we put it back and close. Schneider Electric. This is the front. We're going to go over it in a bit. Let's see what ports we have. Uh, cable in, cable out. This I'm not going to use. Any of this I'm not going to use. I'm just using Wi-Fi for internet. Uh, let's see over here. This is a ground screw. Building wire and fault indicator here. Circuit breaker here. And it says battery plus search all these and battery plus search these and this is just search I turned on the power this indicator is to turn off the sound it'll be beeping giving you sounds uh, if you have problems with a uh, power outlet then uh, here we have the menu and we can see different things, events, if we had any events, this is uh, how many minutes I have on battery, it's 179 because I have nothing plugged in. You're gonna check later when I plugged in my computer. Uh, zero watt, load, we have no load. Uh, percentage wise load, same 121 volt, uh, 60 hertz, uh, and uh, 121 volt so both ways 121 volt okay um, my physics I had like D in physics so uh, volt you know it's complicated stuff bro I connected my uh, desktop and a computer monitor also this will be for charging like small things I have an old version of this uh, with another computer for like 10 years and uh, I think I just changed battery once battery went bad after maybe eight years of use i must warn you do not connect anything super powerful here like vacuum cleaners or hair dryers or some uh, amplifiers with uh, floor speakers and stuff i connected the desktop and uh, the monitor and uh, i still haven't connected the speakers i'm always a little bit worried because uh, they're kind of powerful right now it shows uh, it only uses like 60 to 80 watt but we're not doing anything on the computer even though it's uh, with a big video card here you can even control uh, sensibility um, there is a lot of things you can do through the app and uh, you'll be just fine without any apps I connected one of the speakers we are listening to no music right now and it already shows 145 watt usage load about 160 watt usage right now with speakers connected, I made sure everything connected to power and search. I just turned on uh, a Witcher. They really upgraded the the graphics. And uh, we have here 340. Hmm. It doesn't look like I even use half the power playing Witcher. Thirty six percent and um, fifteen minutes. If I lose power, I can still play Witcher three for fifteen minutes. Shows the load here, so it's two bars of five, which is not much. And battery is not fully charged yet. You need uh, something a lot more powerful to really load this thing. By the way, I always wanted to show that uh, CPU is not that important in the games. Most of games. 
GPU and RAM are far more important. CPU is just relaxing 3%. And it's not even a, something uh, super powerful here. That's the load. If safety of your equipment is very important and if you live in areas with the hurricanes or whatever causes uh, uh, power issues, this is very important for your computer because sometimes in case of power outage, your computer can just get burnt and this thing will uh, most likely protect it. They really changed the graphics so much better now, wow.